Hello again guys, I received this interesting little package in the mail from Impal today, and I thought I would open it up on camera, take a quick look at it with you. This is the Impal M Lens V1. It's a three-in-one lens kit for your smartphone. Cause you know, sometimes your phone, it's got a great camera, but the lens might just not be all that great. Might not be wide enough, might not be close enough. And the three lenses this comes with, it's got a 0.36x wide angle, 180 degree fisheye, and 20x macro lens. So it's a, an interesting little smattering of lenses comes in this little plastic carrying case. Open it up. There's a microfiber cleaning cloth and the three lenses. This first one actually says fisheye on it and as you can see here, it has a clip to it. So when you wanna put it on your phone, you're just gonna clip it open and it's gonna grab like that and it's gonna grab firmly, but it doesn't have anything sharp in there to, to do any sort of damage to your phone. Here we've got the 0.36X super wide, W-I-E-D angle and they've all got these little lens caps on them so you can just kind of pop that off and there's your lens and then the third one in here says 20x macro so i thought we would take just a quick minute take a look at these and see how they do on a phone since i'm filming this at 4k at the moment i wanted to do it on a phone that can do 4k so i may test them on the nexus 5x and i may test them on the lg g4 let's go see this is my rear facing camera on the nexus 5x just sort of moving around in my dining room here. This is about as wide as I can get because I'm back in the doorway in the corner of the room. But very quickly, let me put this wide angle lens on there. That's 0.36x. And there you go. Pretty easy to do. As you can kind of see, uh, it's kind of hard to get this 100% perfectly on there. Some of the corners are a little messed up. But again, standing in the corner of the room, you do have a bit of a fisheye effect up here in the corners, just a little bit of bubbling but that gets a whole lot more area. For something like real estate photography, this could be really, really nice. And then I'll take it back off just so you can see. That's the difference. On again, off again. Wow. And for the sake of fun, let's do the exact same thing with a fisheye lens. So this is no fisheye lens standing here in the same room. And there's your fisheye lens. And this may not be 100% perfectly on, not exactly in the right place, but that gets you, again, a lot of extra real estate. So just for another quick comparison, we have fisheye on. We've got a lot of stuff being blown out over here with this light. So we'll kind of turn away from that a little bit. So we've got the, the lens on now. You can see that massive bubbled effect and lens off. You have no bubbled effect, but also you don't have nearly as much space. And now actually for the sake of comparison, I'm looking here at the, the table, the laptop table that I use. This is just my, my normal camera. If I get down really close, you can see it goes out of focus. But then, if I take this macro lens, we'll go ahead and stick that on. And you probably can't see anything yet, but when I get really, really, really close, look at that. That is the detail on the table. And actually, if I move over a little bit, there's a scratch here. You can see a thorough scratch in the table, super duper close. And you can do it on things like your skin. There's a hair follicle and some skin on my hand. Wow, that is awesome. And there's the fabric on my pants. I'm wearing some pajama pants. Look at the little individual hairs and fibers on that. Different colors you can see. Let's look really closely at the microfiber cloth that they shipped along with it. Look at the individual little fibers and strands that when you pull this away, that's what it was looking like. That's what we were touching. You can see the little circle that had formed. There's my pants that we were looking at. And again, it's the exact same thing there. So you have it without the macro lens. goes really blurry out of focus as you get close. Then you put the macro lens on. Wow. And the biggest thing is just making sure that you have the exact right placement. Wow, that was actually a lot of fun. The Nexus 5X has an absolutely amazing camera on it as it is but the lens is not terribly wide. So for example, if I wanted to do 4K selfie type video like this, at this angle, I'm not gonna be able to see myself particularly well, especially in the video, but with a wide angle lens on like this, it should be a whole lot easier to see what's going on. Although my arm probably looks a little bit weird like this. So all in all, these are not really a bad option. The Impow M Lens V1 are available over on Amazon for about $20. And for that, you get three lenses with three separate clips, cleaning cloth, carrying case, all of that fun stuff. And while I don't think I'm gonna end up using the fisheye lens terribly, 
terribly often. I think my son and I are gonna have an awful lot of fun messing around with the macro lens, just looking at things up close. And because I do make daily vlogs on my second channel, when I'm out and about, if I have a phone that has a camera that doesn't have a particularly wide lens, this might be a good thing just to sort of keep on hand for that kind of scenario. And by this thing I'm waving around, I mean the 0.36 super wide angle lens. Yes, I'm picking on the spelling. But thanks so much to Impal for sending these out and making these available. Thanks to you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do leave me a thumbs up below the video. Let's me know that you liked it. Subscribe to receive more of my videos when they become available, and we'll see you again next time.